Hello there my friends, Perilous3D here back in the house, back for another episode of our pure vanilla, not hardcore, I almost said hardcore there, it's not hardcore this time, it's just regular survival, but man, we're having a lot of fun, I'm having a lot of fun anyway, I don't know if these other guys are getting on here, I know Blue's been on a few times, Stormont's been on, I've only been on a few times uh, and I've captured it all so far, but uh, it's been a little while, it's been about a week or two since I've gone on the server, so let's do that. Let's jump right in onto the Elysium server. We're having so much fun over there in the Crazy Zark world. Crazy Zark. I have to uh, shake, rattle, and roll when I say that. Crazy Zark. Anyway, let's take a look and see what we've been up to. I completely forgot what I was doing. Let's see. Oh, yes, yes. The, uh, <laughs> the uh, nice uh, concrete room here. What would you call it? The stoner room. <laughs> I don't know. This is where I get stoned. No, no. This, uh, this is the communal chest, if you will, to pull a Monopoly term out of my butt. But um, looks like no one has stolen all my goodies, so that's good. A couple things are missing, but that's okay. I told, I told the guys that they're allowed to, uh, to grab this stuff. Oh yes, I'm remembering now, we had an accident here. I fell to my doom last time, yeah, in the lava. So I'm gonna have to fix that at some point. I'll probably do that between episodes. And you know me, I love to say that between episodes, it's my favorite term. But honestly, I, I will do that to spare you the boredom. Uh, but as you can see here, since the last time, I did go up a few levels. I did some dungeon crawling. Do I have anything on my inventory? Not really. But uh, as you can see there, I, I rebuilt all my tools, made some more ladders, chopped down a whole truckload of trees, man. I, I was hard at work getting myself some wood. Because you know wood is just so useful and you can never have too much of it. It's like iron. Just the more you have, the more you use, right? More money, more problems. Um, so let's go take a peek outside. Um, hopefully I don't get jumped by a creeper here. Oh, I finished uh, the front of this communal building here as well. Did it up in brick since there's uh, lots of clay nearby, which is nice. Um, I don't think I started making my animal pen yet. I know animal husbandry was going to be something that I was going to do uh, and invest my time in soon, but I don't think I got around to it. Let me see here. Whoa! Hey, Skeletoni! How dare you? How dare you invade my property? I tried to... Uh, look at this guy coming up here. Mr. Zombo sneaking up on me. Um, I tried to light it up a little bit so that I wouldn't get attacked by mobs at night, but it uh, doesn't seem to be helping. Got a bow now though, which is nice. You want some too? Bring your shovel ass over here. I'll tell you what we can do with that shovel. You can stick it. Whoa! Try to kiss me, see that? Haha, <laughs> I got his shovel too. Hey! Hey, it's a zombie party. What's going on? It's just one after the other. There's a uh an enderman over there as well, and I told myself every time I saw an enderman that I was going to kill it, so once I get these zombie brothers out of the way, I will attempt to kill, no, nay, nay, I will kill that enderman. I just need to find a um, spot to hide and do my cheap little trick here. I might as well just make one. I'll just make a little archway. That's the way that I usually deal with uh, endermen. I know, it's pretty basic stuff. I'm sure you guys all do the same thing. Or maybe you have more creative ways of dealing with them. I don't know. That's good enough for now. I actually didn't need these sides. But if you have better ways of dealing with the Enderman, just let me know. But, uh, I mean, I got a stone sword here, so I gotta be careful and uh, not go too crazy. But enough that uh, I'm gonna bring this guy over here and hopefully get his grass block. Come on, bring it. Whoa! 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 No! No! Oh no! It's not working! Oh, I didn't make it wide enough. Oh, that was stupid. There goes my 12 levels. Now, is he still going to be aggro on me if I get close and try and get my stuff back? I don't remember. Or do I have to look at him again? I guess I'll find out. If I die now again, it doesn't really matter. But, can I get the majority of my stuff back? Yeah, it looks like I can. I got six levels back, at least. That was a stupid death. I don't want to come down on myself too hard, but I could have avoided that. Um, I totally forgot that... I have to get revenge on this guy now. I totally forgot that it has to be three wide, because that's, that's enough to get their lanky little arms in there. So, where did you go, you bugger? 
not gonna let you get away with that. You, you just stay there, punchy. But where is that Enderman? I'll get him back. There he is. There he is. Okay, I'll take care of him real quick. Take care of you. I want to do more than just this with this episode, though. There's a lot of things I feel like I need to do. This is not. This is not <laughs> part of it. Okay, so it looks like uh, he stops aggroing you when you die. So I can go ahead and do it all over again. No! Ah, ah, ah. oh, no! Oh God, no! You're gonna get it now. I got gotcha. you. Quickly before the sun comes up. Give me your block. Yes. I got the grass block too. Sweet. I'll be able to get those uh, in abundance before long. Hey, even got a an ender pearl. Sweet. Okay, well, I kind of exchanged uh, six levels for for an ender pearl and uh, grass block, but you know, live and learn. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll be worth it if I can get at least one more. Maybe before the sun comes up. Hey, I'm looking at you. Hey, hey. Too far away, I guess. Looks like that uh, skeleton's gone. So I'll try and get a little closer. I don't want to die again. Oh, here he comes. Yeah, yeah, bring it. Sun's coming up. Yeah, another pearl. Okay, well, that wasn't terrible. You are going to burn, my friend. You're going to burn soon. Hey, I think I see some evidence of some other people here. Some dirt, or it looks like something got cleared off over there. I'm not quite sure. I have not... Um, he's stuck. I don't know how he got stuck, but he's stuck. I'll let him burn. Give him a little, give him a little shot. You want one of these? You want one? Drive that into you. So, yeah, strangely enough, I haven't really seen evidence of other people here. Um, actually, there's some right there. Stormont's base, he said, was nearby. It was close to the spawn and, and, and near-ish to... Oh, I see the makings of a castle over there. I'm guessing that's where Stormont has set up camp. Looks good, man. Nice starting. I like that. I like the way it's on the... Uh, sand dune over there very cool all right without wasting any more time um not that that really was a waste of time because I, I did get a few things accomplished namely dying no um that stuff's going to come in handy those two pearls uh it's going to be two less that we have to worry about later so i'm gonna get that into my chest dump out some stuff and then we'll keep cruising here and uh, find something to do i don't remember what my goals were for last time I know before the next episode, I, there's definitely a lot of things I want to do. Um, one of them being fix that uh, that mine shaft there, so that I can actually get down with with, with ladder. Well, no, get down with water, get back up with ladder is, is what I wanted to say. But what can we do? What can we do with our time here? I've got no food. Maybe I can go get some food and explore a little bit. Find another biome is what I'd like to do. Do I have any food? I don't even have any. So I need torches as well. Yeah. I don't like carrying them in that slot anymore because it's just a pain in the butt, but I'm going to do it for now. Um, can I make anything with sugar to eat? Not really. Fix my stuff up real quick. Okay, pretty much good to go here for now. I need to go find me some food and do some exploring, so that's what I'll do. Uh, but I definitely want to do more with this episode than just that. So let's see what kind of trouble we can get into. Good kinds of trouble, of course. Not the bad kinds. I've already found that. But at least now I have my little uh, hidey hole for any endermen that come around. Um, one thing I definitely want to do, maybe not now, but definitely before next time, is uh, set myself up some animal pens here. Because I want all three of these animals, or four, let me see here, cow sheep. I didn't see any chickens. So at least those three for now, but definitely some chickens in here as well. What is this? Somebody been farming here? What is this? It's a weird pattern of dirt there. So it looks like somebody started farming or something. Maybe that was me. I'm not even sure. Uh, but I see no evidence of... Uh, oh yeah, I forgot about that that uh, cave down there. I'll have to explore that at some point. I did explore it a little bit, but it just kept going and going and going. The innards of that cave are just very extensive, so that could be a whole episode in itself. 
my view distance is turned down a little bit, but I don't see anything in the immediate vicinity here that is uh, calling me to it. Oh yeah, that's what I wanted to do. I know we have an ocean monument here as well, nearby, but uh, it doesn't really interest me right now, and I don't know what's in there, and it's really tough. So by no means am I ready to uh, tackle that right now, but I wanted to make a boat, I remember now. And that would be the best way of exploring here, because eventually I'm going to want to make my own base that's away from this, uh, whoa, lots more clay over there, away from the spawn point. Not too far away, but enough to have my own little private section. Let's make us a boat and uh, have a gander in the neighborhood. Should probably make more than one boat, just in case. Forgot to make boats there for a second. There we go. Nice acacia boats. Bring two of them, just in case something happens with my first one. Okay, let's go take a look. I'll be able to find, let me note down my location here. So 8976 minus 860, in case I have to get back easily. Let's go across this uh, little lake or ocean, whatever this is, and have a look. Um, once I get into it, maybe by episode, I don't know, 5, 6, 7, something like that, I'm going to pull up the map and we'll take a look at our surroundings once I've uncovered a little bit of this. And uh, the fog of war has disappeared a little bit. So we got desert here. What is this? Is this ocean? It's beach biome, apparently. What happens if we keep going here? Is this going to go on forever? Wow, it goes on for quite a stretch. Okay, we got some snow over here on the right. Some kind of snow biome. Probably the, uh, what is that, tundra? Let's go find out. Oh, I see those nice trees. Those spruce trees, I think they are. I like that. I'm not a big fan of the, the snow biomes, but who knows? Maybe I'll change my mind. Got some ice. Got some snow. Um, what is this? Still ocean. What about now? Cold beach, ice mountains. Cold beach, ice mountains. What is this over here? Cold beach? This can't be ice mountains. Those are pretty weak mountains. Is that really what it is? Yeah, I guess so. Ice mountains. Kind of lame, not gonna lie. And looks like we got more ice mountains over there. Not too interested in this uh, direction, so next time I go venture off, I'm gonna go in the opposite direction and see what I can find, but I am not interested in these ice mountains or the cold beach. Perhaps you other guys that are playing on the server are into this biome. I am not. Where did my boat go? Oh man, did I lose my boat? Was it this far, really? Can't run either, because my food bar is too low. Well, this is exactly why I brought myself a second boat. And I can't believe I lost my boat that easily, but, you know, I've got another one. That's why I brought it. It's a backup. I really gotta start carrying a compass with me. It's... I know a lot of people don't think it's useful, but I like it because it's an easy way of telling very quickly which way you need to go to get back home. That's that's really what I need. It's so easily lost and disoriented. It's gotta be around here somewhere. There it is, I see it. Anyway, yeah, I'm not interested in this. No cold beach, no ice mountains for me. So I'll go the opposite direction, we'll see what we can find, and I'll try and pick up some food along the way. Sun's going down as well, so I may need to stop at the base and sleep. And boy, time flies when you're having fun. It's already the end, almost, of this episode. And I really haven't accomplished that much. Kind of bugs me when that happens. I like getting stuff done, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, keep going in and out of rain clouds. <laughs> rain on, rain off. Okay, well, back home. In the old beach savannah. This is not going to be my home long term. There's no way. Me and uh, me and Savannah got an issue. We got problems. Alright, sleep away the boogeyman. Yes, yes, slain by Enderman. Don't remind me. Okay. Get some food. Keep exploring. After I tackle that uh, door boss. That's right. Burn. Burn, you skeletonies. All of you. And I will reap your drops. Reap your droppings. That sounds wrong. You can definitely use those arrows and bones, though. 
All right, well, looks like I need to uh, illuminate this a little bit better. Black Rabbit. Okay, now, I don't want to kill too many animals here because I'm going to be luring them back to my base before long. So let me break out my other boat here. And uh, if I find some other animals over there, I'll definitely be taking the meats like you, Mr. Sheep. I'm coming for you. That's right. Goodbye. Okay, got, got me some mutton to eat. What is this biome? Still savannah? Yuck. Savannah Plateau. Try and keep my beacon within uh, sight. What is that? Oh, cactus. Okay. Looked like a weird creeper for a second there. So what else can we find over here? It looks like this is another great big body of water. Ooh, I like that. Normal looking tree. Looks like an oak. Maybe a plains biome maybe? Or a small island? Hmm. Let's see what we got. Plains? Okay, well, Plains is not terrible for uh, various animals and uh, potentially mounts. Grab these pigs while I'm out here. Holy, whole island of sassy pigs. Nothing personal, I just need your bacon. Okay, now that I've eradicated this whole island... Oh, no, there's some more. Alright. All pork has been eradicated from the island. Lots of clay here, too. I'll know where to come if I need more clay. Where'd my boat go? I keep losing my boat. Damn it. Some lily pads here, too. Not really a huge need for those, but... Good to know that they're there. Alright, well... I mean, got some exploring done, got some food. Killed a few Endermen. It wasn't a total loss. Not as exciting of an episode as I would have wanted, but, you know. Somewhat beyond my control. Um, yeah, this is gonna go on for some ways, I can already tell. Well, I mean, found another biome. Plains biome, it's something, right? I'm not going to get too far here. So I want to stay productive uh, before next time. Definitely fixing that mine shaft, though. Uh, as I said, creating a drop with water at the bottom so I can get down there easy, and then using my ladders to get back up. I usually do a uh, one by 2 hole, and um, that way there I can just drop on one side and climb back up on the other. Basic stuff. What's this over here? This is not the island. Huh, didn't even notice this on the way by. Is this... It's not swamp, is it? What is this, jungle? I don't know my biomes by looking at them, but... Swampland? Sweet! Well, that's something. That is definitely something. I don't remember what goes on in swamplands. Slimes, maybe? There's witch huts and things like that. I don't know about animals, but that's cool. So that's not far either. That's a nice little swamp swampland island. Cool. All right, well, good to know. Kind of taking the long way home. It looks like I've discovered yet another island. What is this? Forest. All right, so three biomes discovered, or four biomes even, even, even five if I count the uh, cold beach. So I guess this was a productive episode after all. There's yet another biome. Good stuff, good stuff. And then possibly even another one over here. What could this be? Plains? River? No, it's gotta be something else. Another swampland. Interesting. A swampland with lots of stone. That's a first for me. 
a pretty big one too. I don't even know if this is an island. This may go on for some ways. Wow, that is a cool chunk of rock sitting up there. Interesting looking mountain. This looks like a large biome. So it's not just an island. This this looks like it goes on for some ways, and that might be that might be a good spot to explore actually when I come back. So that's around minus a thousand seventy six minus nine hundred ish to get there. Discovering all kinds of stuff all around here. That might be another biome there. Not sure. It could be forest though. Damn, these lily pads are annoying. Okay, well, that's pretty much it for this episode, guys. I uh, don't want to drag you around as I try and find my way back home here. But um, thanks again for joining me. I really appreciate it when you guys drop by and uh, share in our adventure here in the newly formed Crazy Zark world. Not as much activity on here as last time with Loud Cloud, but, you know... In time, the Elysium server, I think, will pick back up again. More people will join. We've got enough room, I think, for four... Either four slots or six slots. I can't remember now. So if anybody out there wants to join us on our server, you're more than welcome. Just let me know. Hit me up, and I will add you to our, our whitelist. And uh, then you can join us and join in the fun. Because the more, the merrier. And as you can see, we have no shortage of room for expansion and to house... Lots and lots of people here sharing in all the fun and adventures that we have. I am lost. <laughs> I'll have to look up those coordinates that I put up a while ago. I don't remember what they were, but I'll have to find my way back home. One last thing to share here before I sign off. A little appenditure to that last episode. As I'm making my way down here, down the mine shaft, I discovered this little cave, found some iron. I hear all kinds of enemies off in the distance somewhere. And I'm guessing it's this huge uh, cavern here, this uh, crevasse, as I like to call them. And that is where I fell to my doom earlier. Whoa! Armored zombies and baby zombies everywhere. At least I got some iron now, and I have enough iron to make myself a bucket and drop some water down there so I don't kill myself on the way down again. So I'll leave that opened up and uh, keep working my way down so as you can see I made my way all the way down there and now I'm making my way back up and maybe we get some water and a bucket and dump it down there and things will be all set up for next time so just wanted to add that in there because I thought this was cool and I'm definitely gonna go and make a bridge across and keep exploring this cave here tackle some baby zombies but thanks again for joining me my friends drop by again next time when we'll continue our fun here in the world of Crazy Zark on the Elysium server. I bow to you, my friends, and I thank you once again. Join me next time, and we'll continue, and we'll keep doing what we do here. It's just self-evident. Take care, be well, see you next time. Bye-bye.